person ages, their brain tissue shrinks, straining bridging veins, blood vessels that extend from the brain to the skull and leaving them vulnerable to tearing. A subdural hematoma usually occurs due to a head injury caused by blunt force trauma. The trauma strains and tears a bridging vein, causing blood to fill the subdural space. If the hematoma is sufficiently large and surgery is required to drain it, there are two options. A subdural hematoma can be treated by drilling small burr holes into the skull. The hematoma is irrigated and evacuated. A drainage system is then put in place. The condition may also be treated with cranial surgery. A section of the skull is removed. The hematoma is then removed using suction and irrigation. Then, the removed section of the skull is put back in place using mini plates or strong stitches.